Hello, everybody, and welcome to Daniel Johnston, uh, late night edition, I suppose, let's call it. For more information about me, you can always hit me up on the blog at macdaddydwj.blogspot.com for Big D's blog, the official blogger blog of Daniel Wayne Johnston. So, what am I doing tonight? Tonight, I plan on uh, doing a little household cleaning, being the... Uh, the the domesticated one. You know, it's kind of weird. When I got married, well, actually, before I got married, um, when, let's, let's, let's rewind to about a year ago, actually, a year ago today, that, uh, I, I was fired from Telvista, from, uh, my previous, well, well, two previous, I mean, not my last job, but the job before that, the one I had for three and a half years. Um, I, I worked at, uh, at PetSmart for a little while, but, that that was I just gonna handle the long hours standing on my feet for that, but anyhow. Um now I haven't had a job basically for a year. I feel really crappy about that as far as for the strain it's put on me and Tab's finances and just our and just all the things that come from having less resources, less money. Um so in this whirlwind of this last past year, pretty much, uh, we've gotten married, moved into a, a new place, and uh, Tab's the breadwinner, and I'm the one at home, which is kind of weird. Never really envisioned that for me. Um, you know, I'm all I'm. I'm probably the most. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't want to say liberal, but um, like. Most feminine guy I know, as far as like, it's still a guy's guy, but like, it has really no problem with women's equality or whatever. Um, <clears throat> like, there's some friends of mine who are like, yeah, but you gotta make more money than your woman, right? You I mean like, if that doesn't bug me. But what does bug me is is my not seeming to be able to get over this hump of being able to find a job. That that makes pretty good money. That does something that I can be happy with. I, don't know. I guess I'm I'm being selfish at some point, at some level. But on the other side, I want to just do something that you know is a little bit fulfilling. That's not just I don't know, just a crap job. I guess I, I explain it as that. Um, although even so, I'd probably take a crap job at this point if. If I thought that that would uh, pay some, you know, bills, but right now it just doesn't even seem like that's doing me any good. So, um, like as far as the job market, I'm not really able, and I haven't really found much right now. So, um, but I'm still gonna keep looking. Uh, I saw a job for Oxy the other day. I'm gonna apply for that. Um, just gonna keep applying for office jobs. Computer jobs. I have a, an opportunity to maybe uh, do some work for the church, which I'm really super excited for. That it's going to be doing some video uh, production stuff, I think. So that that's pretty cool. If, uh, hey, if I could just be a camera operator, I'd be happy about that. I'd put that on my I put that on my resume. I'd be happy about you know that skill, little technology stuff right there. Um, but it's late night. It's about uh, twelve twenty in the a.m., uh, so 20 minutes into this new day, August 10th, it's a Tuesday, so, yeah, it was a Monday last year, that's, uh, that's kind of weird that this day is the anniversary of, of that moment in my life, um, but, but even crazier than that, in some respects, is, uh, we're only six days away, people, six days away, and my cousin, Michael Steven Tibbetts, it's going to be 21 years old. Yikes. That means trouble. No, he'll be all right. He'll have a good time probably, but uh, uh, I don't know uh, what to do about that. Um, where? So so I'm going to go ahead and take you around the house tonight, I suppose, as I do some, uh, some I guess, typically domestic work, some, some house cleaning, you know, old dishes. Uh, other stuff, but you know me, uh, I'm always distracted, a little 
ADD, no diagnosis, just uh, just the symptoms. Um, prove it. I, pro I proved it right there. Anyhow, um, first things first, I guess, is uh, take the the all powerful tomato ketchup, the great value tomato ketchup, um, back to the uh, kitchen from whence it came. <coughs> so, sorry for your uh, inky means right now, over there. It's a PS3 doing something. Uh, what's it downloading? It's downloading a little Geek Beat 18. It's got 65% going. I don't know what the next. Yeah, I like to download a few podcasts every once in a while through the PS3. That way, just watch them on the big screen. <sighs> so it's got kind of a mess in here. Um, I need to unload the dishwasher, load up all of this. I guess I throw some trash away. Put the lamp in the middle of the living room thinking it would give me some more light, but it's probably actually going to be in the way more than it is useful for this endeavor. Of, whoops. I kind of scraped that on the ceiling. What's that? Is that anything? No, it's not a bug. It's just weirdness. Got too many wires down here. Hold on. Okay. To do the very scientific method of moving stuff out of the way with my feet. Alright. Lamp is in El Corno corner. <coughs> this is probably going to be more difficult than I anticipated with holding the phone in my hand while trying to clean up. So, what I'm probably going to do is go ahead and cut this video at about a little over seven minutes. And a big y'all adieu, and uh, get back to you soon. All right, thanks. Again, check me out on mattdaddydwj.blogspot.com.